Meet my friend. Hey, Doug Edrington, Chattanooga, Tennessee. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. So Doug and I have known each other for what, a decade at least? Yeah, at least, at least. And Tennessee is just a wonderful place. A lot of our people in California are coming your direction, right? It's it's like the, the air of everybody moving west coast to like Texas or Tennessee, but Chattanooga has a ton of people moving there. Yeah. Which is good and bad, right? It's pros and cons, however you want to look at it. It's, it's true. It's yeah. true. Well, I've been to your hometown and it's yeah. lovely. I mean, what's not to love? You came to our grand opening. It was an awesome time. Yeah. yeah. So tell our, our clients in California, what what can you buy in Tennessee and what like what does it cost and what does it get you? You know, I've, I've heard stories um, of people that have literally moved to Tennessee and bought a house with the savings and taxes from leaving California, right? <laughs> yeah. So a lot of people come to Tennessee. There's no state income tax. Um, average price point in Chattanooga is about 340000 which is like yeah. a bargain, right? But um, what is high end for us might be more normal for you. So like a six, a seven, an $800,000 house is absolutely insane. You like could, what does that get you? Oh, you could get a great community, great schools, say 750, five bedroom house, big lot, maybe a pool. I mean, just, just really cool opportunities that are there. Um, if you wanna be more like downtown, um, you could you could spend anywhere from 300 up to 3 million. You know, there's there's a, there's a lot of variables, but um, it's uh, it's a really cool it's a really cool town in the sense of it's large enough, but it's also small enough, right? You know, it's it's one of those things you probably heard him heard him say like uh, it's 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 big enough to feel like a big town, but it's small enough to where where like you still get to run into people you know and that sort of thing. So we really like. Them. What what do you love about living there? Um, you know, I feel like I'm pretty well traveled and I always enjoy coming back home. We've got all four seasons. Um, we people are super nice in Chattanooga, yeah. right? You don't yeah. you don't deal with a lot of stuff that the bigger cities deal with. Traffic's not crazy, homelessness isn't a big issue. Yeah. Um, it's uh it still has an old town feeling. It has an old town feel and there's but there's a lot of there's a lot of major companies um, in Chattanooga that bring in a lot of work, a lot of hospitals. Um, Volkswagen has a plant in Chattanooga that opened up. Gosh, I don't know, less than 10 years ago. Okay. They're doubling the size of that. Um, and then uh, downtown Chattanooga is going through this whole uh, growth spurt, I guess you could say, in a sense. Like, I feel like, you know, pre COVID, during COVID, all these towns across the country have just been exploding, right? So, but Chattanooga has done that as well. But there's a huge part of downtown that was basically owned by uh, industry and it's been shut down for a long time and finally the city's gotten their act together and they have put together a uh, a huge plan that i mean it's bringing in tons of businesses tons of homes all along the riverfront um so if you if you want the if you want the boat dock downtown chattanooga that can happen now we we've had so many people that we work with that own rental property in chattanooga that live in california yes. they've never seen it they seen pictures, right. but it's we just manage their portfolio for them, and so so um, having the opportunity to buy a a rental house for two hundred and fifty thousand dollars that rents for close to twenty five hundred bucks a month. So it cash flow and taxes are less than you know maybe two thousand dollars a year. Yeah. You know it's yeah. it's easy it's yeah. easy. So it makes a lot of sense. So for those who are, are priced out of California but want rental properties, want income producing homes that are gonna continue to appreciate. Absolutely. There's a lot of potential in Tennessee. Yeah, yeah, and there's and there's a lot to pick from too because like a lot of people are facing the situation of like a 1031 exchange. They're like, where do I move my money? You gotta do it quickly. There's options. Yeah. So yeah, we work with them all the time like that. Well, we can connect you to the best in the business. Monica's the best too in Orange County. <laughs> Thank you.